This is a tour of my red rocket base. Uh, as you can see, I fenced the whole lot off, enclosing it, making it look a little bit more secure. And I think the way I've done it makes it makes it look not too bad. Now I, I, I like these fences, but I tend to try to put some walls and stuff in there as well, just to break up the, the fences because they could look a little stale over large areas. So if you see, the whole thing is walled off. Now, if, as you can see from the front, we've got a guard tower here and another one here, and we'll head on through the front gate. So we've got a small mute fruit farm here with dog meat house and another guard tower looking out over this side of the settlement. As you can see, there's sanctuary and just a little uh, seating area, with some uh, seats. Uh, this little front porch area. Uh, so we'll head on in here. We've got the uh, the bathroom and a little workbench area, uh, workshop with clinic. Uh, we head on in here. We've got a, another cooking station and a uh, chemistry station. And on in here, we've got two beds. Not too much in there. And we head on out here. We've got another guard tower it's just over here. We can get over this side and a small shack. We head up out this way. We've got just a bunkhouse with a few beds. Uh, nothing special. And a games room, chill out room. The jukebox, TV, pool table. And my generators. Now just a small settlement. So really got away with just using four. Uh, water pump. Go up here. On top, we've got just a little chill out area, veranda, patio, whatever you want to call it, looking out over this way. And a small shack. Now I use the prefab shacks because I think they're easier to place than trying to work out how you're going to put a building into an area. So I like to use them because it makes things simple and it, it saves a lot of time. We'll head back out here. Another mute fruit farm. Sean. Some crafting stations. Scavenging stations, sorry. Another shack with two beds in it, just just to help fill out the area. With a big one. Now this is probably the most fleshed out one. Kitchen. Up here is the bedroom. A little patio. Looking out over the, the, the area. And down here we've got my bar and my general trader. And just in here we've just got a little cooking station, some seats, make it look like a bit of a campfire.